Uh, speaking of Vin, I did read that he'd said, I think earlier, maybe end of last year or early this year, I can't remember, that there was a there was a part four, a script had been written and that he'd, he'd read it. Uh, is that is that part is that you is, is is are you part of the process for a potential fourth movie or is it is it that you're maybe talking about doing another one uh we are uh, yes i am involved in that i just finished the script uh uh three or four days ago and i had uh, done treatments for vin uh in the past so typically i just do a treatment vin looks at it we talk about it decide that this is the story we want to tell and then i go off and, and write a screenplay and I just finished that screenplay three, four days ago. Um, for lack of a better title, we're just calling it Riddick for colon Furia. We'll see if that sticks. We'll see if it changes. But um, yeah, the expectation is Vin's loving it. So the expectation is that we can uh, we'll pop it sometime in 2021. Fantastic. Is that you directing as well? Or are you letting someone else have a go this time? <laughs> I'm the guy. You're the guy. That's exciting. That's very exciting. But I guess in terms of, uh, obviously, are you, uh, are you going to be doing it the same way you did Riddick, the th obviously part three, are you going to be doing it yourselves as in you're going to be doing it independently from a, from a studio system? You want to try and keep it? <clears throat> I think there is an obligation at this point to um, see if Universal wants to be involved because Universal has distributed all three movies, uh, but they only financed the second movie. Somebody else financed the first movie, and then in, we raised independent money to do the third movie. So there's an obligation to see if they want to be involved uh, and to what extent. Ideally, you know, them distributing is a very good thing for us, right? Because they've got the machine, they've got the client. So at a minimum, that's what we would want them to do. So we'll see. Those negotiations will probably start next week. You know? Fantastic. And obviously, it will be, I guess, when you start to shoot, it will be slightly a slightly different shooting dynamic than what you're you've have before given social distancing and everything else but yeah we're we're all trying to understand how that may be possible i don't think we can do what the soap operas are doing which is like <laughs> when when somebody goes in to kiss to kiss somebody else you're kissing a mannequin instead of a human being i don't think we can get away with that in the film so yes there will be um yeah we we're going to be moving slower because of the COVID related precautions. I know that. And that's going to drive up the cost of the movie of, of not just our movie, but any movie. So I'm trying to figure all that out right now, but you know, hopefully, hopefully by, you know, spring of next year, we'll be in a better place than we are here in summer of 2020. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching. Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys, is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey, you 